means the most in life They sing about it every day and night I want it for you, I want it for me I take my chances and let you be free Cause the truth I take Today's festival is in 1949 Ford Custom Let's go for a ride I like it that's a bleed to be 289 under the hood. Appreciate that, Liam. Like he said, 1949 Ford Custom here. This one's got, uh, looks like drum brakes all the way around, decent tires, really nice paint job. I love this car. Dual exhaust out the back, and this was Pops' first car. Not this exact one, but when he was younger, my grandfather, this is what he drove as his first car. That's pretty cool. Check us out at maplemotors.com. I have detailed pictures of this ride, every ride on the car lot. Also have financing and shipping available for you. About that time, let's go for a ride. Good job, Liam. We're gonna look around the interior, check everything out. Place your bets, do you think the horn works? Do you think the horn works? Mm -hmm. No, you don't? We haven't tried it, I promise. All right, we're gonna look around the interior. Check it all out. Looks pretty good, really. I like the headliner, it's nice and clean. Package tray is nice and clean. Back of, seat, back of the seat there, looks awesome. Okay. You just turn the key, it starts right up. Engine temperature's starting to come up. She's still a bit cold. I wonder if a radio works. Looks That's like it. It does it? Already it. Sure, it does. You didn't have that magic touch. All right. Wipers? What about the little wiper knob? Okay, so they took the wipers off on this one. And they're not spinning either. I just pulled it out. But they did. They took them off. What do we got here? Blower motor. I don't think it kicked on either. Old defrost choke. I wonder if that works. Nope, it's not working. Not really sure what that's for. Tax coming up. Oh, I know. It doesn't work anything though. What about the horn? Oh, you was wrong. <laughs> All right, let's go for a ride. Okay, so we're going to take off down the road. We got Liam all buckled up over here. We're good to go. Anything that I see that's wrong with this, I will let you know. Just like this. So uh, if you push all the way up out, goes in reverse, goes into neutral. Hey, he's telling you to shut your door better. Give her a good shut. Thank you. There you go. Now you're good, Liam. We're heading on out. What I was saying about this, it's going through, but you got to push out. It goes down into first neutral reverse it's working great but if you pull it towards you you won't have nothing all right we'll see how she drives she feels good going down the road straight as an arrow speedometer's reading wrong it says we're going 65 I'm only going about 40 a little bit of slack in the steering, you see that? Turns there, turns there. She definitely got some slack. Kick down, not engaging here. As you pull down a gear. Brakes? Oh, drum brakes. Pulling all over the place, but they feel good. They're stopping. Good deal. Well, I tell you what, my gas card has a limit of three, and we need to change that because I go on more than three test drives a day. Gas tank says it's on full, but I can't do anything about it, so. Little turn signal marks coming up. Right there on the end of the turn signal. Look at that, isn't that cool? This is a great car to be cruising around. You gotta manually turn that off too. We're gonna 
I'll pull in this parking lot, get some uh, outside shots. I'm also gonna do a walk around and put it inside the video. So far, so good. Decent ride, feels nice and smooth. All right, let's go over to our parking lot over here, Liam. We'll get you the camera and uh, let you video me driving around you in a circle. Okay. the other turn signal on now. <laughs> okay, let's get these shots. We're going to be walking around this 1949 Ford Custom here. Like I said earlier, 289 under the hood. It's pretty clean engine bay here. Let's walk around, check the paint job out. I like the paint on this. It's going to be very easy to walk around this one. It's uh, nice and clean. Lots of stuff has been replaced. All the chromes. Just beautiful. And uh, I'll try not to miss any kind of flaws. Let's come around the front. Front bumper. Got a little spot there from the road. Checking over the grill. You got a couple little touch-up marks in the corner there. Got one right here as well. A couple chips where the hood comes down. And that used to be chrome. A little weak spot in the paint there, but it's fine. Looking over the fenders, they're in good shape. Coming down the lower portion. A little chip there. A little spot in the paint there. Could be buffed out for sure. Tiny chip on the bumper. About the mid section. Very clean. It's like new lights. Nice little seat there for the hood. Windshield, almost brand new looking. Probably is. That thing looks great. Mirrors, same. All tinted windows. You want that light to work, don't you? Don't you, Liam? We'll look around, see if we can find a switch for it. Light scratches on the back window. Checking around in the trunk. That looks great. You got your skirts back here. Lots of extra pieces and parts. Spare tire. Good deal. How do we come down with this? I think what we do is we gotta lift up, pull this back. Oh yeah, that's what we do. That's a heavy one. Oh, people always call me. It's telemarketers. Yeah, that's where you can lock it. Flip her back around. All right, checking over the back here. Dual exhaust. Couple little bubbles popping up back here behind those reverse lights. Coming down this side. Up over the fender, down the lower portion. I'll stop if I see something, but this one's pretty straightforward here. 
little speck there. I think I've already talked about that one. Back down the midsection. Over the top. Pretty nice tinted windows. Just light scuffs there, nothing to be worried about. A little bit of cracking going on on the vent window. Mirror looks great. Gotta have the curly antenna. Woo! Oh, you do have some cracks right here in the corner of the hood. No good. Okay. There's some right here too on the edge of the hood. You got a chip. There's a little crack there. Let's kind of check around this. Not looking bad at all though. I love this car. Let's go ahead and check the interior out. Door panels in good shape. Weather stripping looks great around it. Look it up underneath. Down on the jam. Carpet's practically new. Seats, same thing. They look awesome. Starts up easy. Sweet. Let's flip some lights on. Maybe that'll work. There's all kinds of switches. That one was already on. Um, and there's another switch. Didn't cut on those lights though. I was hoping they were hooked up. What do they got in here? A little bit of silicone in that jam there. Oh, you do have to firmly shut the doors on this one. I was hoping that was hooked up, but it doesn't look like it is. Those extra switches, I thought maybe it was an electric fan. They're probably not hooked up to anything. Motor is nice and glide on this one. Okay, let's get some undercarriage shots.
Okay, about to head back to the lot. Uh, engine temperature is 160. We're good to go. Waiting on that traffic. We're out here working late, aren't we, Liam? We're hardly working. <laughs> it's got a nice smooth ride to it. y'all are straight get through some of this traffic here we can uh, open her up skirt <laughs> wasn't Ford, that was half throttle, so there's plenty of power left. Car feels pretty good. She is an old heavy car though. The brakes stop plenty fast. What do you think? right around the corner from the car lot. I think we can block the gate with this one. This one's really nice. It's gonna look good out there in front. Look how big the steering wheel is, Liam. What do you think about that? You don't know? <laughs> okay. I appreciate y'all riding along with me. If you have any other questions, check us out, maplemotors.com. This is my son. He's been with me all day riding on test drives and uh, just hanging out. And I think you did really good on those videos, so good job. Backing on up. We gotta come in here on Monday. I'm gonna do the walk around. Hopefully it's not gonna be raining. Hopefully it'll be nice and cloudy where we have some good pictures and the sun's not shadowing everything. I'll see y'all in the next video.